in Africa, almost 90% of alcohol is produced from palm wine. Yes. So, you join me as I take you through the process by which alcohol or local gin is being distilled from palm wine. First of all, you will tap the palm wine by cutting a hole into a palm tree and insert a bamboo pipe through which the palm wine drips into a container that is fixed beneath it. It will be dripping from this pipe into the container that we are using to collect. You cut the surface and from where he's cutting will be the fresh palm wine that will flow. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you. After gathering some quantity of palm wine, you will keep it in a container for about three to four days in order to get it fermented. After this process, you will pour it into the distillation tank and put it on fire to boil. So he's making sure he tight every corner, every space that uh, the vapor can get out from. He's closing every hole. Yeah. After pouring the pan wine into the tank, you now seal it. Come. You now seal it here. You make sure there is no hole. There is no any space for the vapor to come out through. Because the pipe that is that we are connecting here will be the pipe that will lead the vapor through this uh, tank, the first tank, to to the second tank. The second tank is containing water, and the water serves as a, a medium that cools vapor that flows as it enters into the water in the tank. The pipe that is being connected is coiled you know it, it is coiled so the more it run through the coiled pipe the more it pulls this is the final point after the vapor that is coming from the heat where we are boiling the palm wine passes through the water that we inserted the coiled pipe this is where it falls so we collect them here we put the funnel on the jelly can and then the vapor that cools and coming out in form of water will now be collected through this funnel into the jelly can and the, the water that is coming out right now is not just an ordinary water this vapor is the alcohol that we are talking about. Oh,